Good morning. Welcome back. Well, today's show is all about saying, I love you. You know, I love you. From flowers that I love to decorating your home, which I also love to do, but I'm not very good at, so I tug help where I can get it, to some great recipes with olives. And where do you get fabulous olives? Well, we found a place. Check out the Olive Bar at Savory in Appleton. When it comes to olives and a bunch of other great things for a last minute party, they've got it. Hi Amy, welcome to Savory. We're really excited about our olive bar, antipasto bar, whatever you would like to term it. Uh, we have a lot of different olives here. Um, every day we put out new and different olives. It's the largest olive bar that I know of in this uh, area of Wisconsin, in the Appleton Green Bay area. Uh, we have um, usually anywhere from 10 to 12 different types of olives from all over the world. We have the uh, Arbequinas, uh, which have a nice mild flavor, all the way up to the black dry cured olives that have a very intense olive flavor and very dry, very nice. Um, all of these different olives uh, can be paired up with whatever wines, cheeses you're going to put out. We make putting together an antipasto tray easy. Um, and what's fun about it is we will give you ideas on things to go with your olives. For instance, if you're going to do up an antipasto platter with olives, the roasted yellow peppers, maybe some um, marinated asparagus spears uh, or artichoke hearts, we will pair that with different cheeses that we have available here and meats to make a beautiful tray. Let me tell you a little bit about the olives that we have for you. Uh, when you're putting together an olive platter, you're going to want to mix and match your olives. Uh, you know, it makes for an interesting color palette and everything, taste palette, the whole thing. So you've got everything from a Greek olive mix that takes a, a number of different olives. Uh, in the brine, every olive has a different flavor, so it makes a great mix. We've got our dry cured olives that are a real treat, as well as our Arbequina olives over there, which are um, a little bit more mild in flavor. Of course, we have the Kalamatas uh, from Greece, and uh, we have the Negrina with herbs that have just a really nice, sharp flavor to them. So they make a great contrast with, for instance, the uh, Greek green olives that we have and the uh, Sicilian cracked olives. I mean, all of these together, you know, the flavors mix and mingle, and it's just so easy to put together a great tray for entertaining. Um, out of something that lasts for quite a long time in your refrigerator. You can always be prepared for company this way. Uh, then we also, you can add to your platter for a little color and interest, our roasted peppers, cornicons, uh, the pepadus, and the uh, 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 pepperoncinis, uh, roasted asparagus, what have you, to really put together a fun platter to uh, serve your guests. And besides the olives, we have cheeses, we have meats, we have crackers to go with it, we have beautiful breads, whatever you need. And you can always stop next door at Red and White for the wine. So come on in if you're having company this weekend. We'll be more than happy to help you put together the perfect platter.